So now let's see how we can work around with fill color options inside of Microsoft Paint. So on the top, you can see that I got some shapes. And if I were to click on an object and click and drag this around, you can see that I have a, a, an oval shape. So I can go around into, let's say, fill. And right now, the selected option is no fill. If I were to click on solid color, then you don't see any color at the moment. That is because the color 2 is white and the background is white as well. So if I were to select color 2 and select another color, you can see that now there's an orange fill color. If I were to go to fill, I can change the type of the fill according to what I like. So I can change this into crayon so it seems as if uh, it is drawn by a crayon. I can go around and change into marker to make it seem as if it is drawn by a marker and so forth. So let me just create another uh, uh, like oval right here and you can see that the marker is transparent while solid color is not. I can also change it into all color right here. I can change it into natural pencil and I can go around and change it into watercolor. And that is how you can work around with fill color options inside of Microsoft Paint. So I hope you guys learn something as always. And as always, please like, comment, share and subscribe.